Hi guys, I am back with the rocket uh, nose cone and I have more information. So I have here the nose of a uh, M26 ro rocket. It is a big uh, rocket with uh, sub munition uh, with uh, design for truck launching. I will show you photos of the thing. So the, this part, in fact the previous owner did never manage to separate the two parts, it seems. So this part is uh, empty, mostly. There is nothing in it. You can see all the screw uh, holes here are damaged. So inside there is nothing. You can see the very, very thick walls. The only thing is this uh, access panel here. I will speak about it in a second. So about the base, I am not sure, it is quite weird. I think there is a broken part here, with, uh, which was uh, threaded, and it was uh, part of a uh, primer anything system for the warhead. So, this panel here is an uh, umbilical connector, uh, quick disconnect connector, in fact, in this uh, slot. You add a flex circuit entering like this, and which was mating this flex circuit here, and it is for remote uh, setting of the fuse. Because in uh, this part came this thing. We have here, guys, an electronic fuse type M445 435. Here is the information for you. So it is an electronic uh, uh, anything fuse for the warhead. So at the bottom here was the uh, primer uh, anitor uh, explosive charge. It is removed, luckily enough, because it is inert. And at the bottom you have the uh, remains of the armored uh, save device. So, for some reason, it was pushed inside. There is some kind of cap with it is uh, stuck inside. It seems it is lead. And you can see the part here with a metal, bright metal part, is the uh, I want to save a pin, pin thing. I will show you a pictures of this. So you can see electrical wires coming from the side. The unbiblical matching contact for which I uh, detail the patterns in the previous video. And uh, a ribbon cable for uh, interconnecting to of something else in the rocket. Not sure how it did uh, work. So about this fuse. It is a simple artillery fuse, so it uh, triggers the warhead after a programmable delay, and uh, it is powered in fact by this front device here. It seems it is a generator which works with uh, airstream when the rocket is launched. You have air entering here and some kind of magic happens and it makes a little amount of electricity with it. And it is uh, enough to power the building electronics. And in fact it is the first level of security, it is the first uh, arming uh, system because you need to have airflow to uh, power the electronics. So you can see this uh, mounting uh, shoulder here match very very precisely in this part here and in fact you just need the three small screws to keep it in place so mine is in quite good condition in fact because uh, there is a guy on a, on a forum with another one in a worse condition than this oh, I'm very happy with this item because it is my first fuse ever and it is an electronic one. Sadly, I do not know if I can open it. This part here is uh, sealed. It should be destructive to uh, 
release this uh, part. And uh, here it seems we have a cover, it seems we have a thread inside here, but I tried to uh, unscrew it, it is uh, impossible for me, because it is uh, slippy, I cannot uh, grab it, uh, I tried with a vise, but this top part is uh, slips, and I, my own slips, and uh, I do not know if what I could uh, grab this. If you have the holes here, but I do not want to damage them. I tried uh, eating with a uh, air dryer. Nothing happened. I will try uh, maybe uh, again later. So here is the fuse, very nice. And uh, and now I will show you photos I found from the inside, as I cannot take apart uh, this one. I'll show you. Uh, I will show you. Eternal views at least. So, excuse me for the poor quality screen capture, but I think it will do the job. So, here is a kind of rocket. It is coming from part of uh, MLRS rocket system, multiple launch rocket system. So you can see it is a truck with uh, several rockets. It is quite. Uh, uh, it is designed from the late uh, late seventies. It seems the program started in the mid seventies. Uh, so here is the cutaway of the rocket. You have a fuse here at the end. You have a warhead with the uh, sub munition here. Very deadly and dusty things. So about the fuse, here is the uh, other guy who found one. It is on a British uh, forum of uh, the, Brit uh, the British Ordnance Collectors for Network forum. So you can see if one is he has is in a very very bad condition, and he has uh, less uh, parts in the bottom. He is missing the bottom. Uh, metal part and is done to the electronics because in so here is a cut away first so here is the con with a fluidic generator assembly you it seems to have three PCBs and at the bottom the arm and safe mechanism you can guess here the metal part I'll show you I did show you with a little pin, it is this one. The dog. So here is an overview of the rocket launcher. Sorry, I'm back. Um, about the fuse, I did find a PDF from the annual fuse conference from L3 Communications. So here is an overview of the rocket launcher, uh, better views of the uh, rocket with uh, some munition. So this is the original design. The most uh, modern info is uh, censored, sadly, but it is not very important. So here is the first uh, cutaway of the fuse. So you can see the several generations of the stuff. So here is mine. You can see the con, you can see the uh, same uh, wires, set of uh, color rainbow wires on the uh, flex circuit. You can see gas V electronics inside with uh, air tube here, the generator, the electronics here, and here is a little more modern version of it, it seems. So mine is broken at this level here. I am missing this part here and uh, the part I can see inside which is uh, stuck inside must be this one. So here is the story for you. It is against the uh, light armor and the uh, personnel. So the first season was six pack. 
in 1979. And in fact, it is still going on, and they are still doing uh, improvements to it. So, um, a lot of countries did make them. So the thing is that the truck uh, programs the uh, delay in the fuse according to the distance of the target, it seems. It is why there is an umbilical connector. Here is the launcher, the rocket in a little more detail with uh, the submission, M77 submission, more than 600 of them. And here is an interesting info. So here I have uh, some munitions, you can see very bad little things. And uh, we are done to the very interesting part. So the original fuse was uh, this one, M587. It was already using a non volatile memory and a concentration between a well and nitron and Timex. And the company was, uh, who made the letter VM445 is KDI, it seems. And uh, 700,000 of them were made. Okay, and guys, here is the good stuff. Here is the detail about my fuse. So the fluidic, so there is a mechanical arming system. So it seems the thrust, the acceleration of the rocket triggers the arm and save device. And it should need 24 Gs. It is quite incredible. So the electronics are powered with this uh, fluidic generator. Here is the tube at the end, top end. Not sure exactly how it works. It is a safety device by itself. So the, uh, the uh, setting setable time is from 4 to 200 seconds. So there is a piston actuator actuating the, uh, the uh, arm and save lock. And all at the bottom here the explosive output. So you can see the inside, uh, this is the arm and save uh, part, with, which is broken in mine. This, the black part I see must be this one, and the uh, little uh, hammer thing uh, with a pin uh, is inside this. So here are the electronics, you can see, very nice, three boards with uh, an hybrid module it seems. So according to the cutaway here, it is, I could take it apart, but uh, I was not able to do it uh, so far. Okay, and here is the new wear model. You can see the electronics are much more simple. One dedicated clip here and uh, just a few passive parts around it. The two other components here seems to be the same. So this was unsound, and here is the uh, progress of the uh, design for the uh, other parts of the rocket. You can see 
it seems and this uh, conical uh, fuse are now replaced with this kind of uh, flat things but I am not an expert in uh, such uh, sy systems uh, so far so I do not know what they do exactly except that the amount save is the thing that detects if it is time to to go on to explode Yes, and they, co they are continuing to uh, make uh, them. You can see these are really, really nasty things. So, it will conclude and go back to the main interesting place of interest. So, it will conclude this video about uh, this uh, fuse for now. If I uh, manage to open it, by some uh, way, I will show you the inside of mine. If it is not uh, coated in a conformal coating, on a but I don't think so. So, thanks for watching. Bye bye.